Ladies and welcome back, and today in this video I'll be going through the NBA All-Star 2023 reserves revealed. It's revealed, I want to be going an overview on seeing which of the uh, players who made the All-Star reserve team off the bench and who missed out and who was a surprise who missed out. Let's get into it, straight into it. I'm going to go into the NBA app. I'm going to have a look. Now, first off, quick look at the Warriors, you know, shocking Denver lot game shocking coming in we went one and two on this road trip no triple double um no um game review of course but anyway moving on to some positive news here nba all-star reserves have been announced so as you know with the all-star captains in lebron and uh Giannis, they've been announced the starters have been announced for the west and east now this is not the final teams this is just the west reserves and east reserves but the captains will choose what players they want on the day of the all-star game coming up very soon but we're going to get into it now here it is this is the 2023 so you're going to um i'll see if i put it on the screen anyway so first off team Giannis and team lebron so i put this in my community post you probably already know about it but we'll have a little overview so first off for the western conference the bench coming off the reserves all-star reserves first off is paul george and then shea good alexander now first off with paul george paul george is playing for the clippers he's just come off a some type of injury but he's back. I, I, what do I agree with this? I'm going to put a tick and a, agree or fail. Um, uh, for this. So Paul George. What I reckon of him. What do I think of him? He's done okay. He's not, not the best. But he's done alright with Kawhi Leonard. Now Kawhi. On, he's not on here. Kawhi Leonard. He's not on um, off the bench. Now I don't think he is. he a star? I don't think he is. No, nah, he hasn't started. Okay. Um, I'll give Paul George, I'll give it, I, I agree. I'll do, I, I agree with Paul George on the, on the bench, I reckon. Moving on, Shea Gilgis Alexander. What an absolute gun he is. In the Thunder right now, he is averaging like 30.9. He's averaging 30 points a game. That's good. For a player like Shea, he's averaging that much is amazing so Shea really is amazing sorry for that noise I don't know what that was anyway um I'm gonna give Shea that's an absolute great I agree with 100% what Shea's done in Thunder he definitely all, all NBA announcers are agreeing I definitely agree with Shea he's a great he's shooter everything Shea good absolutely next up Jaron Jackson Jr don't know don't agree with that I don't think Jaren, I don't agree with Jaron Jackson Jr at all Damon Lillard, absolutely, he's been coming back from um, injuries. Portland, absolutely stunning. Laurie Markkinen, absolutely, he's up there for most improved player of the year. He's up there, of course. Ja Moran, definitely. Sabonis, definitely. So now, some weird picks for the West. Up there, Anthony Davis, he's a snub. He didn't get picked. What do you reckon of him? James Harden, oh, that's for the East. Um, De'Aaron Fox. He, I think he should be up there at least for Jaron Jackson Jr. De'Aaron Fox. Um, who else got Anthony Edwards? We not. He's been amazing in um, Minnesota at the moment. Uh, you've got Anthony Davis. Yes, he's all right. Um, next, some players in the East. You've got uh, Jalen Brunson. He's been amazing in New York. You've got then you've got James Harden. Like all these guys, unbelievable. For the East now, you got Bam Adebayo, Jalen Brown. This is for the bench. Uh, Demar Rose, Joel Embiid, Tyrese Halliburton, Drew Holiday, Julius Randle. I agree with Bam, Joel Embiid, Halliburton, Holiday, and Randle. Joel Embiid though coming off the bench wasn't picked on these starters. That's what it is there. So if we if we go, that's what the um, player pool is. Team Giannis, Team LeBron. They're all the stars. There are the starters, and that's that's what the bench we got. I'm a bit concerned about the Jaron Jackson Jr. pick. And, honestly, the Paul George pick. Not too sure why would you go there. I would definitely put De'Aaron Fox up there. I think he's pretty, getting pretty well. So this is the 2023 All-Star roster. This is what we've got. So first off, Eastern Conference starters. Now, this is not fun. This is just from the Eastern Conference. Giannis, Kevin Durant, Kyrie Irving, Donovan Mitchell, Jason Tatum. For the West, of your course, Captain is LeBron. Then you've got Curry, of course. Luka, of course. Kyle Jokic. Definitely, and then Zion. So they're the bench reserves. There, Bam. In a in a 
all-star game, I believe Team LeBron will definitely win. Anyway, the West Western Conference coach is Mike Malone from the Denver Nuggets. He'll be he's been honored to coach at end for the East. Joe Missoula from the Celtics is an interim coach, subbing in for um what's his name? Emu Doka been suspended. He subbed in and he, he's done amazing in Celtics right now. But that's really all this video is just gonna be reviewing a review of the All Star Reserves. I would really be I would really be thinking in I don't I really think De'Aaron Fox should be up there. I think what he's done in Sacramento. Sacramento is sitting third in the West. They're very good at the moment. And I think he just needs more respect. Also, I think in the east side, James Harden. We got I don't know. Like, I definitely agree with Tyrus Harden. I'm pretty I'm so happy he's in there. And also Shea Gilgis. I love how he's playing at the moment. So he'll be first ever All Star. First um All Star. You've got Tyrese Halliburton, first all-star. Laurie Markinen, first all-star. Who else? Jaron Jackson Jr., first all-star. So first all-star appearance for most of these guys. Second for Zion. Nine time, 13 time, 19th time, seven time. Anyway, this is really all the video is. Just reviewing on the all-star. What do you guys think? I, I agree with the starters for the West, absolutely. For the East, I definitely agree. I wouldn't put Kyrie up there. I'd either put Jalen Brown or someone else. Uh, for the West Reserves, I agree with Lillard, Jar, Sabonis, uh, Shea, Damian, Laurie Markin, of course. For the East, I agree with Bam, Damar, Joel B, Jalen Brown, Drew Holler. Uh, the East Reserves, I definitely agree with 100%. Now, the guys that missed out, it's a, it's a long shot. Get, becoming an All-Star, being in the All-Star game is amazing, but... You gotta be good. Now, Darren Fox is great. Um, Jalen Brunson's great, but these guys here, in particular, are really good at the moment. So it's gonna be a great All Star game. Great All Star game, but the teams are not announced until the day of the All Star game. So will there be a video on me reviewing the All Stars? Probably not. This will be the last All Star video I probably do. But there it is. All Stars. There's the starters. There's the reserves. So the two captains, LeBron and Giannis, will be choosing their team to pregame. Before the All-Star game in Utah. Anyway, quick look. Quick um, geese um, on ESPN now. <sighs> look what the M NBA is standing up here. Can't just say, put this out here. The West in the NBA is so close. In the East. But if we look at the West. First off, shock and Warriors. I understand. We're shocking the moment. We're sitting ninth. Anyway, the West is so close. From fourth position all the way down to 13th the west is so close there's so many people games in here that are so close particularly from fourth down to 10th it's a ball great you don't know where's everything fitting so all we got to do as worries is win some home games and win more in the group with seven and 20 on the road third worst road record i reckon we can get it done but that's what the west is as i can say i just want to put it out there it's close yes shocking where the worries are but all these teams in the west can get it done it is very close. Anyway, that is it. That's the All-Star um, teams announced, whatever. Update on LeBron scoring. He needs 63 points to pass Kareem. 63. I'm predicting he's going to break it against the Bucks. Playing at home against the Bucks. Kareem played in the Bucks. I think his signature shot will be the hook shot LeBron will pull. I reckon it will happen. I really think it will. Anyway, that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. There's a 2023 All-Star teams. Giannis, LeBron, it'll be a great All-Star game in Utah. We'll curry, we'll curry drop 50 again. We shall see. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Haven't seen the update video. Go check that in. Also, back at school now with the community post and the game reviews. The community post might come out a bit delayed because, of course, games will be during school. So just stay tuned. A bit delayed. You know how I roll. You guys staying with me. Anyway... Till next time, enjoy life and have fun. Peace.